Hello everyone and welcome back to my playthrough of Nobody Wants to Die. Last time we got introduced to our main protagonist who uh, looks like he's been put into a new body very recently and is having problems uh, syncing with it, I guess they call it, uh, although he's keeping that hidden from his superiors. Um, he's a detective with the NYPD. And apparently he's been put in a new body because of some accident that happened that we don't remember. And we have been given a our first reluctant mission, reluctant on the NYPD's end, because we're we want to get back in the swing of things, and they're still hesitant. Uh, they're saying it's too early, but we kind of force them into it. The murder of some kind of philanthropist. Um, what is it? Edward Green, Edgar Green, something like that. So what we are supposed to be doing is collecting the Icarite from his brain that I guess keeps his uh, consciousness intact and all and his memories, I assume. Um, and we're doing it on the down low so we don't create some kind of scandal. And we have been uh, partnered up with someone named Sarah on the uh, in the office. Uh, basically making sure that we're doing okay. And she's the voice in our ear. She's the oracle to our Batman, as it were. Okay. Let's see what's going on here. Shit. James, camera. This was supposed to be an accident. Fuckers hanging from the last cherry tree. What do you mean the last? Like, last last? Mm-hmm. <laughs> Let's pull the echo right and get out of here. And press caps to enter hint mode. No, we don't want to do that. We'll figure this shit out as we go. I'll I'll use it if if I need to. What do they need protection for? Replacing a whole body just because somebody gouged out your eye is... Uh, unprofitable, I guess? Not for him. So this is one of those, like, fen fencing... Uh... Helmets? I don't know what you call them. Although... Oh, well, I guess they're, they're wooden katanas. I was gonna say, these are practice katanas, they're not real katanas. Okay. So what is this? And here he scores a few points. What is points that? For what? This engine oh. could push a car up past 120 miles per hour, running on gasoline on the ground. You know, it's hard enough to imagine driving on the ground and all, but 120. <laughs> nah, I call bullshit on that one. I mean, historically. Got cooked, didn't he? Well, I'm still gonna need a photo for identification. Is it really Green's body? I mean, it could be him. Could doesn't cut it. We have to be sure. Hmm. This is guesswork, James. I won't identify him, not officially. Um. I have an idea, I guess. I have an idea. And you won't like it. This is a federal case, James. And we're supposed to pull Green's Icarite, right, not someone's. Moving on to reconstruction. Hold tab to open the gadgets menu. Okay. Put your gadget away. Reconstructor. Advanced tool that recreates crime scenes. Cool! You can reconstruct fragments of the event based on the information collected. Uh, so hold left button when the left bar is active. Hold right button when the right bar is active. Hold both when both bars are active. Okay. So the reconstructor allows you to rewind time. The yellow arrow in the reconstructor indicates the moment when something significant happened. Oh, I see it. Hold Q to move the indicator 
in the uh, to the yellow area in the Rican structure. If you have moved the indicator too far, hold E to return to the relevant moment. Okay. So I've gone too far. You've seen this. What? E to move the indicator to the yellow area in the reconstructor. Okay. Some kind of anomaly. Who cares? It's green. Pull it sicker right and let's go. Hold E to move the indicator. Enter the anomaly zone and look for more traces. Okay. Point the mouse at Green's head and hold the left button to analyze his sticker rights. <clears throat> the sticker rights melted. So? That's his insurer's problem. Come on, let's go. Sarah, he's dead. What? Like, you mean final death? Dead? Well, just... I, I mean, fix it. Just reconstruct it or something. Sarah, listen. I've seen this before. Look close. Take a few deep breaths. Then we'll start looking for who did it. We have to report this. We have to. Anything beyond that? It, it's... I'm... I'm sorry. Mm -mm. Sarah, relax. You're not doing anything. Got it? You're not even here. <laughs> if only it were that simple. Omega code 112358. Suspected murder. So an unknown substance melted the inner part of the thread. So what happened to Green? Analyze. The right side of the body is more heavily charred. The tree must have exploded after he'd been hanged. Yeah, that's a good point. James. It wasn't just a fire. I'll find the cause and we're out of here. Okay. So hold Curie to swipe over the yellow area in the reconstructor, enter the anomaly zone, look for more traces. Really trippy. So we see the explosion, you got away like that. Yeah. All right. So I'm in the anomaly. So what caused the tree to burn? Was it something on him? I can't see it. Yeah, I know. I'm I'm in here. I look for more traces. Okay. That's pretty cool. The device allows x-ray objects, allows the x-ray objects. 
hold right button and follow the wires to find generator. When you find the right generator, aim it. Aim at it while holding the uh, right button to scan it. It's not a true x-ray. There it is. Wow, I can see you're having a great time. Right. Let's see where this one goes. She already snitched. Submitting a formal complaint, Chief. It's impossible to work under these conditions. I don't want to hear another word out of your mouth. You're going to drop whatever shit you picked up. And you're going to write a clean report about a tragic accident. Got me? Uh, you pronounced murder wrong. I'm not asking. I'm telling you. What you were supposed to do it was pull Green's Icarate. End of story. Uh, can I can I get it on the record that I strongly advised against this course of action? I should have known better. I should have known you couldn't handle it. It's just an incorrect rule, I thought. Surely Kara can't fuck up something that simple. There's nothing to pull. I'm trying to tell you there's no incorrect to pull. Green's got oxidized. It's a homicide. And it's staring us in the face, like it or not. Now, I can look into this and... Not our case. Write it up as a suicide. Oh, it's a suicide. I thought it was an accident. You can call it a motherfucking ascension for all I can. Just get it off our books. This it all stinks. And it's not just Green's rotting corpse. So. Okay, hold on. I, I, I'm I not understanding why they don't want this to continue. I guess they don't want to make it a public scandal. I, I can appreciate that, but... If the motherfucker is like, his Icarite's gone, he, he's like dead dead. You're going to have a scandal regardless. Like, if, if you're going to chalk it up to suicide, that's a big fucking scandal, man. Hold space along with Q or E to speed up the reconstruction or winding. Okay. Someone flooded the transformer and it caught fire. Cable. It's getting more and more obvious. I'll look for any pre-explosion traces, then we're out of here. James. I wasn't born yesterday. You said that before, and I don't believe you. Are there any traces from before the tree exploded? Someone not only flooded the transformer, but also ripped out the cables.
Perhaps murder, perhaps murder. Synthet synthetic gin. Best before June 25, 29. Marcus Aurelius. Emperor philosopher who ruled one of the greatest empires in history. Meditations is a posthumous collection of his personal notes. It is a collection of universal and timeless wisdom, a signpost for all those who wish to maintain a stoic calm and an unwavering view of things in the face of adversity. Someone with the president? Hmm. I recognize him. Wait, it's green. Old shell? The first one. Green, never doubt yourself and you will achieve great things. That's bullshit. Which does not change the fact that even before inventing the Icarite, he was a big shot in politics. What the fuck is this? A bike. Or rather, a wheel off a bike. And people rode on it? How? Like a motorcycle. But you had to push those things around and around with your feet to make it go. Ouch. That's eh, kind of fun. Yeah, I'm gonna look around. Is there... yeah. They knew each other? How old was Green? Older than Icarite. How fucked up is that? Dying in the process of transplanting your own invention. His body rejected it, right? Guess he drew the short straw. That's not what I heard. I heard it was human error during the procedure. I'm just taking a look around first, guys. So he's interested in art. Doesn't seem to be too much he's not interested in. Art attributes to immortality. Central Park has become a museum full of works by the most eminent artists. Come and see for yourself. Gather family and friends. Starting October 25th, totally free. Why is it worth it? Monumental exhibits referring to the culture and tradition of the old continent not only inspire reflection on the past, but also radiate unwavering optimism about the future. The main theme of the exhibition is humanity's triumph over the ills of the past. Over fate, chance, death, and time. Let's celebrate this victory together. All works have been selected under the supervision of the New York College of Art Curators. The sole sponsor of the exhibition is Edward Green. Thank you on behalf of all citizens. Read documents. He was clearly trying to get rid of those. Didn't make it. Or someone stopped them. Dear Mr. Green, as request this from NYPD commander. As requested, I'm sending a list of people you asked for. All of them were cross-checked on multiple levels. Political ties have been confirmed by some of the, some of my anti-corruption friends. None of these people, after conviction, will be able to appeal for any reason. Likewise, none of the relevant political figures will be linked, so risk is minimized. What's the next move? Everything is ready. Steiner. I totally forgot our character's name. Uh, Kara. Last name Kara. Doesn't look like our name's there. Stop moving, bro. Yeah, I don't see our name on there. Uh, Taylor Ethan dead? Or David? Murphy, Noah, Lonely, Roberts, Margaret, in debt, Sullivan, Joe, Davis, Charlie. Okay. Um, 
I'm gonna leave it. Maybe I'll just let sleeping dogs lie. <sighs> Thanks. My blood pressure didn't need to get any higher. Leave the documents. Okay. Ooh. Green sponsored it. When I was little, I wanted to be an astronaut. But after this disaster, Green shut down the whole program. Well, the first mission did crash. Yeah, during the landing, everything else went smooth as silk. You know, it had to be some kind of sabotage. You mix in political bullshit and poof, the whole program goes up in smoke. A view from Mount Olympus. Even though we're all immortal, only some of us live like gods. Look at that cloud. Or those clouds are this literally looks like uh, it looks like smoke billowing billowing over like a miniature city, like a miniature diorama of a city. That's those are some thick ass clouds, man. Anyway. Pardon me, ladies. The Declaration of Immortality. What happened to him? Oops. Read. Why can't I not scroll down? I'm trying to scroll down, it won't let me. Anyways. Interesting collection. Probably synthetic. What you might call tobacco adjacent. Shit, maybe they are real. James, tell me you're not going to steal a cigar. No. I may be a lot of things, but I'm no fucking thief. Oh, and here I thought you had no shame at all. I don't. I'm still not a fucking thief, though. You never got remarried. What happened to the first wife? Refused Icarite. Died a natural death. But wasn't that illegal? She would have had a top-down warrant served, right? Green only introduced that legislation after her death. Hang on. Are you telling me Green couldn't handle it that his wife died, and he fucked up our whole fucking society because of it? As far as I can tell, people's bullshit personal trauma is always what fucks up society. Yeah, that's another thing. Like, why is it illegal to... To die, like die, die. It looks like a door. It must be open remotely. Maybe I can find something with X-ray. Um. Like yeah, I, I don't get why it's illegal to to be dead. Like I don't know why it's mandatory to have a a body prescription uh, subscription. Not required. Open sesame. Okay, I don't know if I'm doing things out of order. Boils on his face. Where the fuck those are? Is that Marcus Aurelius? I don't know what that says. I don't. Uh, I don't speak of the Greek. Okay. What was the point of coming up here? You know those rich bastards have a pool for yachts? What? Yeah. A fucking huge swimming pool, basically. They put boats in it and sail around. But how... 
That's... where do they get the water? Fuck if I know. People like you and me are stuck drinking recycled piss, but they're all, Hoist the mizzen mast, Jeffrey! Fuckers. Is that really how they are? Hoist the mizzen mast, Jeffrey. Jeffrey, I fucking told you. Right, let's check this side real quick. There's gotta be a door here as well. Very interesting place here. Hmm, that's all you have to say? Um, I don't know why he would need, like, secret doors. Fuck, I need Smell the sample. Guy has a fragrance museum in his home? Aromatherapy helps with synchronization. Aromatherapy? Sure. Pity we're all rolling around in sewage. <gasps> James, is that chocolate? That's what it says here. Can I, um... Oh, can I ask you to do something for me? Nope. What, you want me to steal evidence? I thought you had a stick up your ass about thievery. No. I mean, yes. Listen, could you... <sighs> could you describe the scent to me? It smells like chocolate. Let's do it. He's got a cupcake in there. How would you describe kind of like the smell of chocolate? Ah. Tobacco, grease, or mushroom? I mean, neither. None of those things, really. But it's been there for so long, it probably does smell like fucking there's shit growing on it, you know? Um I don't fucking know. Let let grease. Let's put grease. Sort of like grease, but it's soft and gentle. That's how it hits the nose anyway. Tell you what, why don't you try describing it in a way that doesn't sound <laughs> gross. I give it a shot. I give it a shot. Like, how would... Yeah, how would you describe it? <laughs> Cigar, rubber, or leather jacket. The closest smell would probably be a leather jacket. Like a uh, leather jacket. You know those relic clothes from museums? Made from animals. Like that. Okay, um, let's try this another way. Uh, does it make you feel something when you smell it? Emotions? James, anything. You think it's edible? Glossing right over the emotion talk. Okay. Look, that sample's probably over a hundred years old. Food spoiled in the past. It could make you really sick. Food spoiled in the past. Food doesn't spoil anymore. I guess everything's synthetic. Okay, emotions. Let's see. It's dark. Bitter and warm. It uh, fills my heart with joy, I guess. Is that good enough? So, soft, fluid grease, huh? A leather jacket from a museum, and you feel joy in your heart? Exactly. Okay. Um, thank you very much. Let's get back to work.
Anyways. Plato, Socrates' defense. Remember, my friend, the gadfly needs to bite. Yeah. Is that it? Want to comment about the horses? Okay, let's head back down and let's figure out what the fuck's going on. Is that? Do they have wings? Horses? No, pegasi. Um, Sarah, that's a oh. horse. Pegasi are mythical creatures. <laughs> Some paleontologist you are. These days, horses are mythical too. Mythical animals are fictional. No, mythical animals are fictional. They never existed. Whereas horses are extinct, like dinosaurs. Oh, that's sad. <laughs> of course. Thanks for the lecture, Professor. Hey, you asked for it. James, end of topic. Let's move on. It's scary how little we know about the world before the Icarite. <sighs> no wonder they don't teach this in school. It's gone. How does that make sense? Because, like, the picture we saw upstairs... No, the, the Icarite thing over here was from late 2000s. Yeah, 2012, 2076, like, there were no horses in the late 70s, like, in the 70s. Like, wouldn't he at least, like, remember them, have pictures of them? How do horses even go extinct? Anyways. Uh, let's reconstruct this shit again. Uh, okay, so we were here. Analyze the blood. Someone tried to smash that glass before the explosion. Cracked it and left a handprint. The handprint matches Green's body. Stop it. James, you've got to stop this. Finally paying attention. Great. So, now the question is, did Green try to crack open that plate with his own forehead, or did somebody else use Green's forehead like a ball-peen hammer? Why can't we see the killer in the reconstruction? He covered his tracks pretty damn skillfully. So someone was here. Fucking hell. What? You gonna tattle to the chief again? Would you just let that drop already? What's done is done. No point in picking at it. No, I'm not gonna let this go. Holy fuck, Sarah. There's Brazen, and then there's... whatever you are. Uh, just get on with it, alright? Feeling sorry for yourself is a bad look. Fuse is just blue. What? Why? The reconstructor needs massive amounts of energy. Sometimes the limiter doesn't adjust to the environment and pop. Blue fuses. There you go. So I don't have to do everything myself after all, huh? A man could get used to this. I just shifted power from three different neighborhoods so you can keep playing detective. Don't make me regret it. 
So... Something went off here. Ambrosia. Oh, Eunomia. You have some per day or is prescribed by physician. Check something out for me, would you? I need to know about a drug called Prose of Life. Introduced in 2208. It's based on fluoxetine. An antidepressant. Uh... How long did Green get psychiatric treatment? Looks like he's officially been in therapy for 156 years. That's a long ass According time. statistics, that's pretty much normal for people who've lived as long as he has. It'll be worth checking the file to see if he mentioned anything about a suicide. Probably some kind of relic. To the best of friends, always auspicious winds. To the best of friends, always auspicious winds. Green. That asshole had friends. Hard to believe. I'm getting a bad hit off this thing. I wonder which one's the best friend now. I wonder why a gift from Green is in his own home. See what the patient has to say. Where are you? There you are. So it's just the uh, this little first area. Oh, there we go. Matched to Green's blood type. He was fighting with someone. Or he cut himself as he jumped. Sarah, think outside of the box. I can come up with obvious ideas myself. Are there any traces of the time of Green's jump? Let me check. That is a good point. But there's footsteps. And a handprint. Blood. We'll come back to that later.
So we're looking for green... The green, uh, jelly. This is the the hint system. I don't know what it's doing though. So the tree is moved. Oh, it's up there. Sorry guys, this is, it's a little confusing what needs to be done. Construction is inconsistent. Someone must have been messing with it. We don't have enough information to find the other one. How do you think this went down? I think the attacker did it himself. They fought. Somewhere in there, the attacker slipped the rope around Green's neck. Well, in any case. Green didn't jump. Someone pushed him. Yeah, this is a this is a full-on homicide through and through. There we go. Wait, there's a blood trail here. You must have gotten cut before the hanging. Do you have a UV lamp? I don't leave nice. home without it. So it allows you to discover traces on surfaces. Uh, explore the area to discover traces. Follow the traces to find more leads. Just walking up these stairs. Oh, I see. Blood type BRH. Hmm. 
I'm missing something. No footsteps up here. Is this doing this yet? I don't know what I'm supposed to be doing. Prince here. Hmm. Oh, you have to fall. Usual shape. That is so stupid. He was lying here. That is so stupid. That is really fucking stupid. Trace of blood. Hit it with the UV lamp. Oh, look at that. The tracks connect. Deserve it, or I feel sorry for him. I'm gonna ask did he deserve it. You think he deserved what he got? I do, but it still wasn't enough. Shit! Sounds like you hated his guts. <sighs> oh please. Got something on his clothes. Some kind of chemical? Huh. The reconstructor's coming up goose eggs on its composition. Must be rare as shit then. Stretches across the floor. I'll switch to UV. Tracks lead this way. 
unknown substance. Looks like Green was rummaging around the Transformer. Someone made him do it. The following substances were detected synthetic spirit and cockroach wax oil. they're able to reconstruct all this. There's something here. The Ouroboros thing. James? <laughs> I've lost visual. Honestly? Honestly, you don't want to know. Whatever. The feds are on their way there, so consider this a heads up. They find you. I don't fucking know. Are you? You're serious? We've been friends for fucking decades and you're gonna hang me out to dry? I guess that's a yes. How's the situation? They're coming. Time to clean up. Sarah, if we're gonna keep working together, you're gonna have to promise me something. What? Nothing else behind my back. That you'll never do anything behind my back again. Are you fucking kidding me? Are we gonna pinky swear? Should I let you know every time I change a fucking tampon? James, the feds are coming. So, grow a pair and please, with a fucking cherry on top, clean up this mess. Whoa. Yes. Now, come on. Move before they bust us. Leave the apartment. Use reconstructor clean up crimes seen or not okay um, and I'm actually gonna stop there because this episode went on a lot longer than I intended um, I apologize if I haven't been speaking too much during this uh, during this episode I've I'm really um, trying to grasp what how they're doing things it may seem simple like watching it but when you're actually doing it, when you're in the thick of it, there's a lot of things like to consider. Because um, like the other thing is like I'm, I'm exploring and I don't know if I'm doing things out of order. I don't know if there's this actual sequence. Um, I was trying to do it before moving on in case something like this happened, right? I don't know if we're under a time constraint now to clean up or um, like we only have limited amount of time to do things. Um. I like where this is going. It's more involved than I thought it was going to be, which I like. I'm I'm happy with. Um, but I'll definitely be uh, talking a lot more now that I understand the the mechanics of everything. But yeah, I hope you guys are enjoying it. At least I hope you guys are enjoying like what uh, what kind of style of gameplay the this is going for. Um, I honestly don't know how long this game is. Uh, it seems like it might be a little bit long, probably close to like 20 hours or so, but hey, we'll see. In the meantime, guys, thank you all so much for watching, and I will see you in the next one.
Take care.